Welcome to Storytime. My name is Andrew Newman from the Conscious Bedtime Story Club, reading The Tree of Goodness. Storytime starts with the snuggle breathing. Please join me with these four simple breaths. Breathing in, I breathe for me. I breathe for you. I breathe for us. Hmm. And I breathe for all that surrounds us. That helped me feel more relaxed. We're ready for story time. Our story starts with a goodness question. What makes a tree good? Hmm. Is a tree good because it makes us wood or shade to enjoy a picnic? Is a tree good because it makes a chair where we can rest our derriere? Is a tree good because it makes us fire that warms and cooks when we tire? No, that's not what makes a tree good. Hmm. A tree is made out of good. It starts as a seed, sprouts tiny roots, branches and leaves. The good becomes wood that grows tall or bends, standing alone or with a few friends. Sometimes it's leafy or knotted with bumps. Often it kinks and has a few lumps. But that's okay. Hmm. A tree is good without any reason, flowers or leaves, no matter the season. A tree is good with no work at all. It's already good, short or tall. What makes a tree good? The answer is this. A tree is good. Just how it is. The end. At the back of the tree of goodness, you will find the goodness stretch. This is a way to relax your body and stand in your goodness. And you can make this stretch your bedtime reminder that every cell in your body is made of goodness. First, Plant your feet on the ground. Feel roots stretching out of your feet into the earth. Then stretch your arms like branches to the sky. Feel your trunk tall and strong. And close your eyes and connect with goodness. Remember to smile. And then take three Deep breaths to complete. Good night. Sleep tight. This has been a reading of The Tree of Goodness with Andrew Newman and the Conscious Bedtime Story Club. Thank you for joining us.